I think it's important to acknowledge that hip and knee replacement surgery generally is elective, which means that it's, it's booked in. It's not emergency surgery, but sometimes I think it, it might feel a bit demeaning in a way as a term because elective surgery doesn't mean that it's not important. Um, right. Or that you're not struggling or don't have symptoms. Yeah, it's, yeah. it is a, you know, it is a term that almost sounds like you want to have surgery. And, and that's not what we mean. You know, we certainly mean that um, it's not a trauma or an urgent surgery that, um, you know, if you broke your leg, um, that would be a urgent surgery. Um, but if you're booking in and, you know, you're coming to see us and you're kind of going through the normal procedure in order to have a knee or hip replacement, we would call that elective. And actually, lots of surgeries are elective. So basically anything where you're booking um, and going to have the surgery is is considered elective. Yeah. Yeah. I don't want to trivialize symptoms no, by calling no. it that at all. Yeah. So we know, um, and a lot of times, you know, the, the pain from hip and knee surgeries or um, hip and knee arthritis, patients have rated it on these scales as, as being worse than death. And so we recognize that as healthcare providers. And, and we've had lots of conversations about what are we going to do during this period when, when people who are awaiting surgery um, are suffering. And it's a really hard thing. And so um, everybody, I think, is aware and is working on it. Yeah, no, indeed.